This is the FLL 2019 to 2020 City Shaper Possible Missions Preview by Diamond Cube. Here is a game. Here is the game table with a smaller mat and a smaller base than the old red quarter circle in past years, with possible extra storage workspace on the west side. And it may include on-the-fly brick building for missions and may allow for open-end strategies and block placements. Here, this is an overview of all possible missions. We'll go through each mission in great detail. We'll completely open up your imagination. Here is a game table reveal at Houston World Festival. You can use either the Spike Prime robot or the EV3 robot. Both are allowed in the competition. Here, this is a yellow crane. And a fallen building and a fallen building on the east side and a swing first let's take a look at the first mission there is a crane with a weight and it looks like the weight can be dropped. Mission one could be to lower the cargo weight from the yellow crane to the target blue circle. To get full points, you need to put it inside the circle or outside to get partial points by operating the two blue handles. Mission two could be to place blue building blocks from base and field into the shipping area black circle scored by number of blocks and stacking or not here is a live demo for mission one using spike prime at houston world festival here is a Live demo for Mission 1 using the Mindstorms EV3 at Houston World Festival. What mission could this be? This is a very obvious one. Mission 3 could be to stack the building blocks in the black circle of the residential area. What mission could this be? There is a tree and a lamp and a bat at, in the base. What could it be? Mission four could be to stack building blocks on center top of the tree to build a tree house. For mission five, maybe you drop a small block into the bird's nest on top tip of the tree. Mission six could be to hang the bat from the tree. And mission seven could be to hang the lamp onto the bridge on the pole with the blue dot. Take a closer look at this build. Does it look like a big turkey? Ha 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 ha. Here is another mission, obvious mission. We do not know exactly what to put in the red circle, but we guessed that you place the flower sample from base into the red circle. 
What mission could this be? Is it to move the trucks and cars off the bridge? What are the blue handles for? It looks like the platform can hinge on axles. Mission 9 could be to clear the road by flipping the panel over to lean towards the south wall using the blue handles. And it could possibly have another mission to move the cars and trucks back to base depending on if the plates are attached to the panel. This one is a very obvious mission with the swing. But how can the swing move? Mission 10 could be to push down the blue stopper to start the swing. And mission 11 could be to deliver the sandbox sample from base to the beach circle on southeast corner. It's not very obvious. Look at what the man is holding. And pay attention to the black circle. Mission 12 could be to place a tan color building block into the excavator black circle. Mission 13 could be to tear down the traditional power plant and bring the intact top building, which is white, back to the base. Mission 14 could be to place a white color building block on top of the white building in the white circle. This is a very interesting mission. What could it be? First, we have an easy mission. Mission 15 is to deliver the solar panel sample from base into the brown color circle in front of the Boomtown Build building. Now pay attention to, to the movable parts on the building. There are frictionless pegs. Mission 16 could be to turn the building upside down to have the blue block rotated to the bottom and the tan block rotated to the top and the big yellow parentheses to face east, sun. What mission could this be? Could it be to raise the building upright? The, and it must be on the base. Mission 17 could be to lift up the building to set it upright on its base. It is very easy but very, very tricky. And the building must be upright on its base. Well, th this is a very exciting mission. What could it be? It looks like the flags can be raised with the frictionless peg. Mission 18 could be to raise the red flags on top of the bridge by pressing and holding down the blue paddles. If both flags are raised, then both teams get double points. However, if only one flag is raised, the team that the flags the team that the flag side is on will be the one that gets the points, no matter who pushed it down, who pushed the flag up. And we already went over mission seven, which is to, which could be to hang the lamp loop onto the bridge post with the blue dot. Here's a summary of all the possible missions. And here's a description of all possible missions.
Thank you for watching, and good luck to all City Shaper teams. Presented by Diamond Cube.